This is Takeshi Kaneshiro, the popular actor who starred in the PlayStation 2 game Onimusha Warlords. This groundbreaking title marked the first time that an actor was cast as the lead character in a video game, moving the industry to a whole new level. Three years later, June 2003, at an undisclosed location in the city, once again, Takeshi Kaneshiro has returned to the world of Onimusha to reprise the role of the hero, Samanosuke Akechi. Listening intently to the director's instructions, this serious face no longer belongs to Takeshi the actor. He has already become Samanosuke, noble warrior from medieval Japan. In the first game, Onimusha Warlords, Takeshi Kaneshiro played a character in a video game, something no one had ever attempted before. One of the reasons he was able to pull it off so convincingly was because he loves playing video games so much himself. The recording session is back on track. With his fine acting skills, Takeshi Kaneshiro is able to breathe life into the Samanosuke character. Everyone in the studio is drawn in by his passionate performance. He never breaks his concentration. And with that, the recording session is over. Finally, a relaxed expression. Samanosuke has returned to Takeshi Kaneshiro, the actor. Thanks to his work today, the game is one step closer to being complete. Now, let's take a look at the final product. The main character is Samanosuke. Here, he meets Nobunaga, faces his destiny, and the story unfolds. You'll have to play Onimusha 3 to see the rest. July 2003. French movie star Jean Reno arrives for his voice recording session, marking a new page in the Onimusha trilogy. G. He arrives in a cheerful mood. With his lines already memorized, he wastes no time getting down to business. The session progresses smoothly. He works with the director and the production team, striving for a perfect performance. Philippe, il faut partir. Mais non, non, je vais pas te laisser. 
Viens, viens. Accroche-toi. Quoi une illusion d'optique euh, Ouais, parce que je pensais, tu veux pas que je dise avant, euh, arrête tes salades. Non, bof. This veteran actor exudes the same presence in a small voiceover session as he does acting in a blockbuster film. Henri, Henri, ça va? Qu'est-ce que tu fais là? Now let's take a look at the finished footage. Philippe, il faut partir. Non, laisse-moi. Va-t'en, Jacques. Mais non, non, je vais pas te laisser là. Accroche-toi. Allez, viens. Viens. Ah. Et merde. Encore eux. Crève, Sharon. Next, we go to another place somewhere in Paris. Here, we will see the real Jacques Blanc come to life before our eyes. Here is Jean Reno in his motion capture suit. His goal was to immerse himself completely in the world of the game. Jean Reno plays the game as his character, Jacques Blanc. He is recreating the character in his mind as he watches. He knows how he has to play it. And so the motion capture filming begins. His performance is captured on the computer, and we witness the moment when Jean Reno becomes Jacques Blanc. He finds it hard to contain his excitement. He had a lot of fun today, and it showed. When it comes to his work, Jean Reno never compromises. His goal is to create something that will touch everyone that sees it. This is true of all his various film work, as well as this extraordinary game. He has a message for gamers everywhere. Ceux qui vont jouer en Imusha 3 au Japon. Ils vont faire un voyage dans le temps. Ils vont partir de France et vont partir de France aujourd'hui jusqu'au vieux Japon où il va y avoir des monstres et des samouraïs. Allez-y, tuez ces monstres. Moi, je vais venir. This opening movie won the Best of Show Award at Seagraph, the largest CG conference in the world. With motion capture sessions filming both humans and horses simultaneously, the Onimusha series has continued to innovate, creating yet another CG masterpiece. <laughs> 